Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, folks. Michael Zuber, one rental at a time. And serious question, actually. Didn't know I was going to go here first, but we'll go here first. Is it okay for me to have a favorite video of the week? If it's okay, this is the one. Uh, this is the video that I give you every Sunday. Uh, it's called my community video. It's where I give you a quick snapshot of what is going on in our private Facebook group. Facebook group is called One Rental at a Time Works. It is only available to the players or the people who have taken the opportunity to buy the How to Get Started One Rental at a Time course. Let me bring it up. Let me give you a taste of what happened this week. And again, we have an entire playlist. If you want to go back and look at the last 52 weeks or more, you can do that. Playlist is on my channel. Uh, I have lots of playlists on my channel. Have you checked any out? If you checked out some playlists, what's your favorite? Maybe it's Anna Kelly, Greg Dickerson, Hot Takes, Live Streams. Don't know. Let me know what your favorite playlist is. Leave a comment below. I'd just love to hear. Here is the best post, number one post of the week. This, is, this might be the best post of the year. Doesn't sound like much, but I put my first offer ever for investment property. Even if it's not accepted, it's a win. Yes, we should all stop, applaud, congratulate. This is exactly what I hope happens. What do I do at one rental at a time? Buy box, daily discipline, learn average, grow your network. Eventually, when you find a good or great deal, write the offer. You may not get it. I wrote lots of offers not got the deal, but having the confidence, getting past that point of being nervous, afraid, unconfident, not confident. Best post of the week, best post of the week. Congratulations to everyone who is doing the work, writing the offer. Hey, and if you don't get this one, I promise you there will be another one. Congratulations. I do want to step back and they say thank you to everyone who gave uh, the One Rental at a Time community ended up giving over $7,000 to Toys for Tots. Some of you did it via my mother's link below. Some of you did it to your local charity. Everything counted. As always, I'm an easy grader. Some of you donated toys. We counted it. It all added up to over $7,000. Last year, 12 months ago, this channel gave away just over $2,000. So we tripled the donation. You know how cool that is? Do you know how many smiles we are gonna put on kids' faces this year? That just makes me feel good. That's awesome. Here's a post from somebody who took the one rental at a time course and actually is giving back. Folks, if we are going to help a million people, my life's mission is to help one million deals get done we need to share one rental at a time. I simply cannot do it myself. If you're a part of our community, thank you, thank you, thank you. Invite your friends, tag it on social media, take selfies, Instagram, cards, books. If you get interviewed, please share something about one rental at a time. Uh, I just want to thank each and every one of you uh, for doing that. Thank you for your service. This was obviously uh, foreign service, so thank you very much for that. It is, it is awesome to see that what we teach, what we talk about is changing lives, and it is changing lives in a way that you want to push the idea of one rental at a time. It's pretty cool. This is a fun question to think about. Hey, I bought a house in 2008. 2008, pretty good timing. Uh, for 70 grand, its current value is 300. Time in the market beats timing the market. Congratulations. Uh, do I refi it? You know, take it to 75% LTV or sell? Current interest rate on the refi would be about 4%. So a couple of things to think about. If you sell it, you probably pay the tax man unless you're doing a 1031 exchange. If you sell it, you lose out on the cash flow. Uh, if you do a refinance, do not create an alligator. Read in my book, One Rental at a Time, how I blew that up made a mistake the first time. Uh, generally speaking, lots of people had comments on this uh, post. Uh, most people said refi and keep investing. Uh, but yeah, it's fun to think about, right? And again, congratulations on taking the steps way back in 2008. Here's one. Uh, again, I've been here, been there, done this before, made the mistake. 
I lost out on a property because I offered 5K below asking 185 versus 190. It was in the great deal category either way. Ouch. Ouch. At 190, it was a great deal, but you, you offered 185. Ouch. I guess it was ego that didn't want to offer asking price. Anybody else have a weird internal response to offering at or above list? Yeah, I do. Yes, I do all the time. Uh, it actually took me a while to get by it. There was a time where I wouldn't offer asking. Asking is just a number, right? But what I've come to realize now in the last couple of years is uh, offering asking, if it's a great deal, is okay. Some real estate agents don't know how to price stuff. They price them low. Uh, I know uh, Matt, uh, the lumberjack landlord, has done a couple of deals and actually paid over, right? He has bought a couple of duplexes, triplexes by paying over asking because the properties have been mispriced. So again, know your market, always do a great deal. And yeah, let me just say one more time. I have made this mistake before. I have lost great deals because I was cheap. I wanted that I wanted that discount. I wanted to make it extra, extra special. I have been there. I feel your pain. Again, lots of more content coming. You can be a part of this group for as little as 300 or 600 if you want one-on-one -on -one mentoring. We are adding large multifamily syndication, Burr, Section 8, mobile homes, and more and more and more and more. Prices going up January 1st. Don't miss out. Lots of you are, but don't miss out. Again, book selfies, book reviews. Uh, greatly appreciated. If you watch my goals video, you know we got nine book reviews and we're looking for 10. So we just missed. I think next period, we're going to start counting book selfies. So let's start sending some selfies around. Tag me on IG. Have your friends think about it. One rental at a time or 15 conversations with real estate millionaires. It's greatly appreciated. And again, here's the course. It's helping well over 2,000 people now how to start one rental at a time. If you are ready to stop being a spectator and get in the game of money, here you go. Do it now. Buy yourself a Christmas present before uh, the price goes up and you need, need to buy it next year uh, when it's significantly more money. Take care of yourself. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.